up everybody it's titanic fee jack and i'm back at you with another video before we get started today i need a couple things from you i need you to hit that like button on today's video also need you to leave a comment in the comment section on today's video let me know your thoughts on the video and the sneaker we're about to look at today and if you haven't already i need you to sub up to the channel and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified to come back when i release some great content now today we take a look at a sneaker here release today is saturday february the 11th uh it's the day before the super bowl and uh I don't work and I went and picked up my sneakers. I hit on the Hibbit raffle for these. So we're going to take a look at the sneakers. I do have two different size categories. So you can compare and make a decision based off of the looks that we're going to uh, present to you today. You see the box probably have seen this box before off of early reviews you got the gray speckled box with flight and white and you got that pale vanilla jaw jump man right here the little 360 of the box and there's a look at the size and tag I'm gonna read it out loud see it's Air Jordan full retro SE and the color is photon dust Hail Vanilla, this is a US size 9, and these retail at 210 bucks. And we also have the GS, this is the other size category, the GS. It comes with a black uh, box top, red jaw jump, and flight in white as well. Give you a 360 of that box. And this how your box tag looks on the grade school pair, and it reads the same. Just a little difference, Air Jaw for Retro SE, but there is GS in parentheses, standing for grade school, and the color again is Photon Dust Pale Vanilla, and this is a size 7 wide. Flip open the box top, you got a pale vanilla inside, box top, no lot stamp right there, you got your splatter on your paper, which is a little smooth on one side, a little rough on the other. You got a little additional white tissue in here as well. And you do have your green and white YCM sticker inside. And that's all we get with the uh, men pair. Yeah, so let's see what we get with the gray school The gray school pair comes with a red inside of the box top. No lot stamp. And it has the same splatter paper, smooth on one side, a little rough in the other. Also comes with your additional uh, tissue, but it also comes with a Jordan Jumpman sticker, as most of the grade school Jordan 4s come with. The grade school sticker. Uh, let's check. Yes, you do have a. YCM sticker in here, the green and white YCM sticker, and you also have another sticker right here. I believe that's like a lot number sticker or the quality control sticker. It actually, says QC3. So these are both boxes. Let's get into some shoes. Here we go, guys. We have the Air Jordan Retro Full SE, the Crab. First thoughts. Let me know your thoughts on the sneaker, on how y'all like it little 360 let's get into it it's made on that photon dust base photon dust is basically another color for gray i believe that term probably refers to space life or anything in space you have several different materials on the sneaker uh like on your lace eyelets right here you got that crack leather material there and on your wing extender right here you have smooth leather right here on the toe box and going around your side and around your ankle padding and you do have a snappy suede right here with that little patch and on the uh, mud guard and your uh, quarter panel your uh, netting has been replaced with suede right here on your quarter panel you got that's three different materials I've listed in all the same colorway of photon dust you do have your pale vanilla wafers right here 
and that is pretty much for the upper we're gonna go to the midsole the midsole is made of polyutherane material you do have like a charcoal gray color right here with a little hit of that white it could be possibly seal because it looks a little darker on your midsole going around your air housing you got a clear bubble and it has a white inside of there and it's gonna lead to the outsole. Your typical John Ford outsole herringbone traction. You got the full tone dust colorway here. And at the toe with all the stars, you have a pale vanilla colorway going right here and on your jaw junk man with a little uh, charcoal gray color right here in the herringbone traction. And bam, you got that hit of sail or ivory right right there we're gonna go to the heel of the sneaker you do have a pale vanilla jaw jump man and you have this uh your tag bag here is sort of sort of translucent and if you peel it down you do have two different materials here you have the smooth leather right here i want you guys to see that and you have that crackle leather right there Moving on to the medial side of the sneaker, a continuation from over here with that crackled leather on your, uh, this is on the inside of the medial side, crackled leather on the uh, ankle collar. You have crackled leather, actually, it's actually tumble leather right here. My mistake, tumble leather on this wing extender. You have crackled leather going down your eyelets right here. You got smooth leather on that uh, wing extender right here and onto the toe box and the uh, netting has been replaced with suede. And you have that same color seal, polyutherane midsole going around your air housing, clear bubble, white inside. You got that hit of full tone dust right here and you have that charcoal gray. And we're gonna go around the toe box. This is the toe box, nice smooth leather. It does come stuffed with uh, your tissue right here. And this is what your insert looks like. It's Dream Cell, charcoal gray, full tone, uh, I'm sorry, pale vanilla jaw jump man, size and tag. This is the back of it. This is what your insert looks like. Comes, uh, factory lace one set of laces you got this uh, full tone dust flat laces right here and the tongue the netting is being replaced right here as well you have that suede all the way up to here you have a full tone dust woven patch you can see that with a pale vanilla jaw and jump man and you have the word flight in white you also have a uh, suede on the tongue you got that high cut you cannot see behind it unless I turn it around and show you we have pale vanilla uh, cushioning behind the tongue and you have a woven patch in that pale vanilla and it says air jawed in white and it is upside down you do have a charcoal gray or darker gray sock liner going on here and I showed you guys the uh, insert already I'm gonna try to read the uh, size and tag to you, give you a good look at that. Let's go ahead and read it. Size nine, production date. June 8th of 2022 to August 18th of 2022. So about two months of production with these guys. So this is the men pair. This is how the men pair looks. And here is the grade school pair. Here is the grade school pair in comparison to the men pair. They look pretty much identical, just the sizing difference. But the only uh, major difference that I noticed on the uh, pairs is that the grade school right here, the insert does not come out. They do not have the dream cell insert in the grade school pair. You have that tissue right here. So it's just like the other one. And of course the box is different as well both of them have that little indention right here that i almost forgot to mention not sure why they did that and not sure why they did that patch but both sneakers had that so this is both pairs the men and the gs pair of the uh air jaw retro for nike craft 
I also hit on encoding and I hit my personal size on sneakers so I won't have a uh, on feet for you guys right now unfortunately but I will try to post that at a later date you can catch my reels or my short stories here on YouTube if you're interested in seeing that on foot so if you guys want to see an on foot I need to get them likes up let's get about 20 likes on the video and we gonna get that on foot to you guys soon as that pair comes from the sneakers app but this is pretty much it for the review so again leave your thoughts in the comment section don't forget to sub up to the channel and hit that notification bell and let's always tell you guys if you can help someone get a sneaker help them get that sneaker because you never know when it will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker i'm titanic feet jack signing out